Hello and welcome back to another video for Final Fantasy XIV with me, Mioni. Today we're looking at a new parasol that was added in patch 6.1 to treasure map portal dungeons. So if you're unaware, you can get one of these time-worn Cumbera skin. How do you even say that? Cumbera skin maps, uh, which is the eight player level 90 uh, maps you can do these with less than eight players if you so wish to as well I, we've done like a, a three-man run and it was fine but sometimes in the last room if you get to the last room you can get some cool stuff one of the items is the white lace parasol this is a frill rimmed umbrella perfect for any weather except rain used to unlock a white lace parasol so uh, obviously we can't use this in the rain because it's made of lace quite useless it's kind of like the chocolate kettle isn't it basically just for decoration as you can see if you go into your um your menu for as you can see if you go into your character menu over here on the main commands tab you'll see fashion accessories this is where this is stored like every other parasol we've acquired and uh yeah this is basically what this looks like let's put this on our bars we'll just quickly remove the pizer just for a second and it's also as you can see you can use change pose to actually change parasols now you'll notice that this icon will be next to parasols from 6.1 onwards now um basically that can be used with change pose so you can actually tilt the parasol you'll notice that the wings do not have this um, but they'll probably add other interactions going forward most likely but for now it's change pose on the parasol specifically so let's have a look at this parasol then whilst we're here and it looks like this so this is the white lace parasol it is made of obviously white lacy fabric uh, quite a nice texture honestly it's not the worst thing in the world i would love the ability to actually dye parasols i know that's like kind of weird because they're fashion accessories and most people think that fashion accessories don't really have much use outside of RP uh, or photographs, which is the whole point of them anyway. A lot of people think that fashion accessories should be allowed to be used in combat. Whilst that would be awesome, I think it should be limited to stuff like the wings. That would be cool. But I don't see how a parasol would necessarily work in combat unless we were reenacting the Avengers or something. You know, the old thing. Wasn't it? who was it from the avengers that had like the umbrella i can't remember british programming who knows um so basically this is yeah this is the white lace parasol if you want to get this at the moment it's on the market board as well people are selling this uh, for about 10 million gil so you might want to wait a little bit it's not impossible to absolutely obtain but i think the reason that the price is where it is at the moment is because most people don't realize that treasure maps don't only have new materials to make the new glamour which is the varsity outfit by the way the new jacket and beret combo but also has some other items including feathers to get a mount and also this particular parasol so anyway let me know if you're going to pick this one up yourself so we're going to do a quick change pose to show this off. That is so much better than it was before. I thought we'd highlight this feature, and this is the first time I've done it. That looks so much better than just the static, I am holding a parasol. Photographs are going to be so much easier to um, you know, put together, where we actually look the part as well. You know? We can see so much more of a parasol as well. I really, really like this. And this change pose works pretty much as far as I can tell with every parasol, but I don't own every parasol. I still miss the one from the gold saucer, sadly. I just haven't had the time to do the triple triad matches. Now I started recording again because I just uh, realized that there's actually more than one pose with the parasols. So there's actually one where you have it on the back as well. You can just simply press the minus key that it's defaulted to or change pose again. And we can switch between the static look, the over the shoulder, which I think is absolutely fantastic for photographs. But there's also this straight on with it behind your back. I didn't realize that. But yeah, this is a really nice item. Let me know if you're going to get this one or not. Um, obviously waiting for it to come down in price or if you do it with your own fc or group of friends do yourself some treasure map dungeons there's lots of stuff to have uh, to be had in there so i would recommend it especially if you're wanting to make some gill now is the time for certain 
Much love. Enjoy the rest of your day. And I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.